All right, I'm standing at the front door here for the tortoise property. It has been beautifully renovated from top to bottom. You'll notice the wood flooring throughout all the main living areas. Here to the right is the formal dining area. It has high ceilings over that area. Right here in the entryway, it's a little bit smaller and then it opens up straight ahead towards this formal living area. On top there you can see the nice openness. Of course, fresh paint, neutral colors all throughout. This flooring is a nice um, flooring. It's actually a, I think it's a high-end laminate flooring. It's got the distressed um, hand scraped look, which is great. Um, here immediately to the left, you've got these French doors that open up into this room. This would just be a traditional office normally, but you could use it as a guest bedroom if you wanted to. It doesn't have a closet, but you do have these doors that you could close if you wanted to. The formal living area right here is a nice big space. There's a couple of step downs you'll see. So this is kind of a, a half step right here. And it goes all the way over there. So that formal living area is a step down. And then also over here, let's take a look at the, um, the formal dining. You have a little step down. So you have these columns right here. But notice the, the step down into those areas. And there's the front door where I was just standing. You have a guest bathroom right here which is great. Um, this is a half bath. Nice pedestal sink. Brand new tile floors. Brand new toilet. Coming over here is the master suite. Let me turn off that fan. There we go. Um, so again, nice tray ceilings up there. You've got the ceiling fan. Beautiful um, fresh carpet. Let me give you a, a quick view. They haven't cut the grass. They need to get the grass cut, but um, nice view of the back pond, which I think you'd love. You have this um, French doors right here that lead out onto your covered porch, which is a really nice size. Now let's go over to the master bathroom. I really like this. I mean, this is a beautiful Totally remodeled bathroom. Notice the mirrors. Nice thick three centimeter granite with the undermount sinks. And then this tile flooring is also really neat. You've got a, a very high end brick style, I guess they call it the, uh, the way that they laid it. But really nice. Here on the left, you've got a big walk in closet area. Lots of space right there. Coming back around. Right in here is your water closet. And then you've got this garden tub that's a really nice size. And they did the, you know, the very in backsplash with the glass and stone mixed together. And then right behind me you have the remodeled shower and again you can see just the the beautiful glass and then they did the diagonal cut here with the different tile up top and at the bottom so just some nice nice finishing touches all right let's go to the other side of the house now uh, the kitchen is is fantastic and the neighborhood, I think you just would really love. It's Most everyone has a brand new roof on it. Um, very well maintained yards. This is the one where it needs to be cut the worst. Um, they evidently haven't gotten their guy out to, uh, to take care of that. Take a look at all the nice recessed lighting here above the kitchen. I think that's a great touch. It really just makes it a bright kitchen. Um, look at the, the nice backsplash. And again, the real thick granite. I mean, this is a huge bar top, so I really like that. The cabinetry is probably just the original cabinetry. They put on some nice um, handles, 
so those are, look good. And the uh, the tile in here, I also like. It's really a nice looking, 24 inch. Looks like porcelain tile. You've got this built-in microwave, and then the smooth top stove right there. And then here's your built-in oven. All of those appliances look brand new. And again, just the amount of money they put in this home is great. They really spent money well in the kitchens and bathrooms. All right, so now you've got a view of your family room, which is, again, real nice size. I love the fireplace. Again, they use the decorative tile and glass. Here on the left is your breakfast nook area. Just right here, you've got a nice spot for a small table. These same floors, the nice big wide plank wood laminate flooring. And then they put in these nice little, you know, niches or little alcoves right there. That's a great touch just to feature some of your artwork. Same thing here, take a look. You've got these built-in picture areas right here. And right here is another one. So just some really nice t touches. Um, all right, coming in here, you've got two bedrooms on this side split by one master uh, by one full bath. So right here you can see just a nice size standard room, probably 11 by 12. They used an upgraded carpet. This is not a builder grade. This is definitely a nicer carpet. That's the um, one thing I noticed uh, some of this glass, like here you can see, yeah you can kind of see. It's fogged up. You can see some of the water that's inside the glass right there. So there's a couple of glasses, uh, windows that I saw that are fogged or where the seal has been broken. But again, nice view of this lake in the back. Um, ceiling fans in all the rooms. Coming across, you've got a little linen closet right here. And then your full half bath right here, also with the granite, which again, just a great touch. Nice tile flooring. Got the decorative mirror and some upgraded lighting. And then a completely redone shower as well. Really nice touch with the glass trim. And let's look at our last bedroom right here. This one also has a ceiling fan, but um, nice carpet. This one has a walk-in closet which is a nice touch. Let me show you the laundry room quickly. As you see, they've just they've poured a lot of money into this place to make it look sharp. So right here is your laundry room inside, which I know you prefer. Beautiful tile flooring again, the same from the kitchen. That goes into the garage. Let me show you here is another kind of a coat closet. Always nice to have extra storage space. And let's poke our head into the garage. Pretty much standard size garage from what I can see. Um, I think you have a brand new air conditioning system, right? So that looks great. Hot water heater is probably unoriginal or older. Let's see. So probably inspected. Yeah, not sure what the age is on this one, but it looks a little bit older. Not a very major expense typically. Um, that's it for the tour of the home though. Looks great.